going to show you how to make chicken broth from scratch today. This is commonly used for making kopiak sen and is a great base recipe for other soup dishes. So we're going to start with three cloves of garlic and some ginger. Remove the shell from your garlic. And then we're going to peel the ginger and you just want to take the skin off around it. So now we want to mince the garlic. And then slice your ginger. You can either cut this into thirds or cut it in half. This is just to flavor the broth. So turn the heat on to medium heat. Add about a tablespoon of oil. Just let that warm through. And then we're going to add the minced garlic. Mix this around and we want to get this slightly browned. Now that the garlic is browned, we're going to add the chicken. So stir that all together. The garlic latches to the chicken, so that's going to give it more flavor and also make it aromatic. We don't want to brown the chicken. I tend to just cook it until the skin just turns like this golden yellow color. Now we're going to add our chicken stock. Gently scrape the bottom of the pan to lift up the garlic. Add a teaspoon of salt to this. And your ginger slices. Stir that around. While the broth is going, we're going to prepare the vegetables. So I've already pre-washed my cilantro and my green onion for the garnish in the soup. Add this all to a bowl. Take a spoon to gently combine this all together. Now I'm going to remove the chicken from the broth. As you can see, the stock has reduced. Chicken has now cooled down, so we're going to shred this up. I like to remove the skin from it first, and then take a fork and start shredding the meat from the bone. I'm going to move the meat onto the cutting board. And some people do like to eat uh, the soup with some of the meat still on the bone. So I'm gonna leave a little bit of the meat on the bone and then I'm gonna add it to the pot. This is an optional step, but you can slice the chicken skin into thin pieces and then add it back into the soup. Some people discard it. I like it in there. And then with the chicken meat, you can either shred this with your fingers or you can take a knife to it and add this back into your bowl. Gently add the chicken back into the broth. Then we're going to turn up the heat to about medium. Let this come to a boil and then it's ready to be served. added the cilantro and green onion that we previously sliced up to my soup and the rest of these accompaniments are optional but I like to add lime, some bean sprouts, chili oil, 
I like it extra spicy, a little bit of sugar, some fish sauce, and a little bit of fried garlic. Mix this all together. Happy Friday. I just wanted to start off by apologizing for the lighting in my house today. With daylight savings and everything, it's kind of thrown off my time to film. Plus, if you're following me on Facebook and Instagram, you know that I just started a new job. So I'm trying to get this filmed before I go into work today so that you guys can go into the weekend knowing who the giveaway winner is from my previous video. I have all the names in a cup and I just wanted to thank all of you guys for your support. I received so much good feedback from my first video, so it makes me super excited to get more videos out to you guys. Also, if you have any suggestions or comments on how I can make the videos better, please let me know because it helps me and I want this to be a good resource for all of you guys. So, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and make the drawing. Congratulations to Thomas Sir Dude Keys. We'll be contacting you via Facebook within the next 24 hours to collect the appropriate shipping information. Again, thank you, thank you to all of you guys.